right, y'all. So I'm going to address this one time and one time only because it seems like a, a lot of y'all had an issue with me, Christina, who's personal life is her life and her choices are her choices uh, it seems like a lot of y'all had an issue with me accepting uh, a coffee date as a first date I'm sorry I've been on plenty of steak dinner dates and uh, three four course meal dates that have ended in a bill being five hundred dollars one time six hundred three hundred I mean none of that matters because why I'm not with those people anymore so what regardless of a man taking me on a steak dinner to a steak dinner or to coffee it doesn't matter I don't really understand like why y'all feel like the first date has to be dinner do y'all not feed yourselves do you not work every day do you not have money to buy your own self buy yourself a steak I'm confused it's very apparent that some of y'all are telling on yourselves and it's very apparent that a lot of y'all are just using men for a free meal okay because if you really wanted to get to know somebody, if you're really interested in somebody and they ask you to go to coffee, um, that wouldn't be an issue. Um, you can you can feel a person out regardless of if you go and have a steak or if you have a cup of coffee. Um, for me personally, I wanted to just get the feel for this person, get to know the person, a, a good two hours of spending time with this person before I go to have a sit down dinner with them so for me i don't see an issue with having coffee i don't see him being cheap um i'm just not really understanding the mentality of women these days i understand that y'all are saying oh set the standard otherwise they'll blah 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 no i beg to differ and i think sometimes these new the new age women i'm not putting myself in that category because i see myself more of a traditional uh woman i'm definitely not a feminist y'all can have that 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 movement is not for for people that look like me um so we have to be careful with all of this oh if he's not taking me out to a steak dinner then this and that and then y'all be mad when they go and date other folk okay so them standards that are way way up here um, if you're not getting any dates, if you haven't been on one or two dates this year, your standards might be too high, sis. Okay, we got to be realistic at the end of the day. And in my opinion, I don't see anything wrong with going for coffee, having a conversation, getting to know the person, making sure y'all are on the same page before this man goes and spends two, three hundred dollars on you. I mean, I don't see the, the pro problem with it um, because when you're dating with intention, and when, when you're dating with a purpose, um, honestly, the last thing on your mind is a steak dinner. Um, you just want to find your person at the end of the day. And, uh, and, and too many of y'all have these just outlandish standards. Y'all want people to pay your bills when you just met the person? <sighs> it's so ghetto here. And y'all, some of y'all are ruining it for us good women who are traditional and just want to get married and have some damn kids okay now you see that's what i like to see an actual woman speaking the truth and holding other women accountable the truth is is that a lot of women are just serial daters and they're only in it for what they can get that might be lunch that might be dinner or it could just be attention a man to be the emotional tampon and listen to all the problems throw him in the friend zone See, it's all a game. A lot of these women believe that men have to come out of their pockets to prove, to validate their worth to women. And what happens? Drama. Nothing real. D dinners. Chivalry. Which really doesn't exist too much anymore. All those things are traditional. A lot of these women don't even deserve it. I'm not spending no money on no woman that I'm just going to meet. For what? That's reserved for the woman that has a place in my heart. That's at the top of my list. That deserves that. Every woman that you run across as a man and you want to get to know does not deserve that. 
but men fall for it a lot. That's why women continue to do it. A lot of simps and a lot of men that just don't know, that don't have a clue. Maybe they just were married and they, you know, now they back in a dating scene or they have no experience at all. And they hearing all this stuff from all these women and media saying, yeah, treat women like queens, prove your worth to a woman. Those are the men that are going to do that. But for a lot of men with experience, we know better. Those women don't deserve that. And those women that don't deserve that are going to lose to this woman right here. 